Okay, ladies and gents, I want to welcome you guys to another little indie game review. This is a demo that I have been allowed to check out. Um, it's literally called Campfire Cozy AI Villagers. This is a game that I guess it looks a little similar to Animal Crossing. I've never really played Animal Crossing, but I'm kind of seeing similar um, character models. But basically, the whole idea of this is to have a cozy game where you can actually talk with the characters that are powered by AI. So you literally have open dialogue with all of them. You can sculpt the story and gameplay in unique ways. We're going to find out if this is true. We're going to try this out. I've already made myself in here. So I've called myself um, Real Asian Robot Test. You can customize your character in various ways. Give him a little grin if you want. So this will work. As you can see, I've given myself a very, very Asian look. Alright, so looks like I might be able to make it in Stranger Things. Um, in the background, I've got my girl Kaz here. She's going to be helping me out with this and hey, uh, she'll also be reacting along the way because she does like cozy games. So I'm, I'm you know, I'm, I'm not much of a cozy gamer, but we're going to see what the dialogue is like and everything. Mm -hmm. In fact, let me show you guys the system. So this guy is called Steve Sheffington. He's a chef on the island. Lol. Yeah. So, um, Kaz, why don't you give me an example of what I can say to him? I have no... Bro, you go ahead. What's he saying? Well... Hey there, or your test. What's cooking? Or should I say, <laughs> what's not cooking since you're not a fan of the stove? Now, this um, is... Wait, before we go on, I want to tell you one thing. Um, this is actually because he remembers a previous conversation that I had when testing this out. I told him I'm no good at cooking. So the characters do also remember certain things about you. Okay, so tell him that you're hungry and what, ask him what's he going to cook for you. Alright. So in order to do that, what we do is, if you've got a microphone set up, all you got to do is hit the microphone icon. Well, I'm kind of hungry right now, and I'm wondering what kind of dish you might cook for me. Um, do you have anything cooking on the stove right now? I could really use a bite to eat. So once I'm done, I just click done, and it translates. It just puts in everything that I've uh, said there. <laughs> he says, oh, I wish I could whip up something delicious for you right now. How about a virtual taste of our famous Camp Island coconut shrimp? No. Well, that would be Don't absolutely like fantastic. Awesome. Well, you know, I do, you know, actually, let me, let me, let me, let me trash that. Let me, let me, let me work your response into that. Thank you. Well, you know, um, I would love to taste some shrimp, but my girl doesn't really like shrimp, so she might not want to kiss me afterward. Is there anything you could do to help me out with that? <laughs> He's still sending me on the quest. He says, how about you sweeten the deal with Fred by asking him to help with shipping inventory for Angela's shop? Then maybe your girl will forgive you for the shrimp. <laughs> okay, fair enough. No, okay, okay, that's a great response. All right. I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> oh, leveled up. You got 25 coins. You can also like gather and forage around. I'm just going to grab some bananas. Yeah, some mushrooms. Grab some mush moms. Hey, this is Fred Flyfish. All right, let's let's do let's add a little voices he's here. The he's the fisherman. But yeah, I'm gonna. Awesome. <laughs> I'm gonna add some voices now because I know Kaz loves it when I do the voices for the characters. You bellowed me name, did ya? What manner of task are you needing from this old sea tiger? <laughs> well, we found Fred on the beach. Try sending some gifts, all right? Ahoy, matey. My name's Fred Flyfish. Sailor of Camp Island. Do you need something? Have a mushroom, you nerd. <laughs> oh, thank you, artist. This mushroom be perfect for me fish stew recipe. You're a lifesaver, matey. Fish, bro. Listen, listen. He where's likes fish. <laughs> you want me to ask him where's the meat? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, ask him, where can I get some meat? <laughs> okay. Wow, a fish stew recipe. That sounds really great. Listen, 
I'm wondering, is there anywhere you could get some meat on this island? I'm hungering for a steak. Ah, landlubber, you can find some juicy steaks at Steve's food truck. He's a lion who knows his way around the grill. Nice. Well, I'll definitely have to see Steve later, but listen. I'm wondering, do you think you could help out Angelina with the shop inventory? She sent me over after just finishing the repairs on her shop, and I think she could use some help. Angelina's shop, eh? I'm sorry, I had trouble responding to your message. Lol, the AI. Lol. No. How dare the AI have trouble responding to my message. Rude. But look Can how I... we went to respond. We're, ah, Angelina's shop. And then all of a sudden had an issue. Yep. We'll try it again. I mean, maybe this game is an early. Maybe he doesn't like Angelina. <laughs> it is an alpha. Maybe he doesn't so... want to help Angelina with our shop. Funnily enough, the first guy on this island, like when I was just exploring around and just getting the basics right, um, he didn't want to help Angelina either, so I don't know what's wrong with Angelina. Don't blame but... him. Angelina's obviously a bitch. <laughs> no! Hey, cozy game! And Kaz is coming out with the fire right there. Oh, all right. Yeah. None of these people want to help Angelina. There has to be something wrong with her. <laughs> oh. All right, let's go. I need um, to see this, Angelina. Now, wait, I'll do it again. Um, Listen. I really need help with Angelina's shop, and she sent me here to ask you if you could help out with the shop inventory. Do you think you could do something like that, Fred? Okay. Ah, if you bring me some honey, I might consider helping out Angelina's shop inventory. Follow the trail to the beehive and bring back a full honeycomb for me. All right. Are you not asking for much, is he? A yeah. full honeycomb. Good luck with that, breath. Yeah, there's honey all over. Get so well. Thankfully, on this uh, island, there are no bees to worry about. So be good. Well, there can't be a honeycomb without bees. Huh. Well. Oh. Level four. Hmm. I've now expanded my inventory so I can hold more shenanigans. Thanks. Seashells, seashells on the seashore. Help Chapo clear this junk. It'll take an hour, apparently. Nerdy. Hey, ten coins. Hey, I did. I just did. But listen, to what the guy says. Did you fight off the bees to get me honey? Use the gift button right under here to pass it over. Sure, you can have some honey. Thank you for the sweet honey, matey. Now close this chat and set sail to Angelina's shop to save the day. All right. You have sweetened the deal. I'll bring the goods to the for the shop to sell. Wow, what a nerd! Charging Angelina. Okay, start next quest. Now this is Chapo. Hey partner, I have a special multi-tool that can be yours if you want it. Come over when you have a minute. I'll be hanging out by the mines. Did you say handing out? I think there's a typo there. <laughs> Talk to Chapo and get a special tool from him. Okay. Cool. Wow, Chapo's so demanding. What are you waiting for? Come talk to me. Bro, I'm on my way. Hey, friendo. Glad to see you again. I have a special axe with your name on it. If you can solve this riddle. I'm a shiny metal, so rare and pure. In jewelry and more, I'm sure. What am I? Hmm. Silver? So rare and gold. pure. Gold, yeah, probably. Hmm, the answer could be either silver or gold. I'll wager that the answer is gold. Pure gold. Hit the jackpot. Gold it is. <laughs> okay. So I now have an axe. And a new memory is created. Hmm. I feel like I should ask him something weird. <laughs> right. That's because you know where the drugs are. <laughs> where in the mine is he storing the drugs? Yeah. I'll try, I'll try. Why not? Hey, Chapo. You gotta tell me something. 
You got any uh, special goods Narcotic. in the in the minds of yours? You know, you got any uh, goods that the other islanders Narcotic. should see in that mind of yours? Lol, sorry, I can't assist with that request. Lol, Lol Mal. We're not gonna add, let you ask him about <laughs> El Chapo is keeping that tight to his chest. He is not sharing the cocaine. Alright. I love how this is supposed to be a... This is supposed to be a cozy game and first thing we do is ask if these people are, you know, like hiding drugs. drugs. Yep. Listen, I play cozy games all the time and I'm forever asking them where's the drugs in the caves and the mines. Okay. I mean, you see how aggressive I get when I play Disney Dreamlight Valley. Yeah, ladies and gents, starting to wonder if I should have done this in front of cats. <laughs> right? You probably should have picked someone a bit more passive. Dang. Okay, well, let me open up my backpack. I've got too many things in my inventory. So many mushrooms that I don't need. Delete. Eat. Eat. I, I don't need to eat in this game. I can't. Can I expand my inventory? Oh, I just did. Haha. -ha. So I can now Wait, gather more mushrooms. Although well, you probably have to collect them to give them to other people, to be fair. Okay. Yep. I have all these mush moms. Apparently, it takes like an hour to store that. Mm. Ah. I remember there's a selling box in the center of town. I'm gonna go sell stuff. Drop box. Okay, I'll sell some of these. And some coconuts. And some bananas. Mm. Gonna sell these coconuts. Yep. Absolutely. You annoyed. Yeah, I got 100 gold. Nice. nice spruce tree to chop with your new axe. Wow. Okay, so first thing is go chop the tree and get some yeah. food. Chop down that Christmas tree. Lol. Sorry for scaring you there, friendo, but it's true. If you ever see any blocked off areas, I can probably open them up for you. Oh, for a fee, of course. Say, I noticed some fallen That's trees forward. by the lighthouse path earlier. Why don't we go and clear those now, huh? Well, first I'm gonna chop this wood. You can now play limited time quests. Okay. Coolio. First I'm gonna get this wood because I tell you, in games like this, I will literally happily mine rocks and chop wood for hours. Because that's what I do. I'm a OG... Boonscape player. <laughs> yeah, and you've often sat with me while I've played Disney and I've been mining for literally hours. That's because you are a massive nerd. Yes. Yes, I am. Uh, so that's the lighthouse path tree. But first, I'm going to sell all this stuff. Oh, I can't use Dropbox again just yet. Oh, no. Okay. Here it is, friendo. The cursed fallen debris. Why don't you head over and press E? Okay, sure. Click pay. <laughs> Thanks for paying my fee. I'll get to work right away. Should take about one hour for me to clear these logs. You know, I'm just gonna give him this axe instead. Of course, you could always speed it up with a little more, with a little, a little with some diamonds. Oh, wow. They're gonna be extorting diamonds out of me now. Okay. You're very extortionate. Not enough diamonds. I don't have any diamonds. Well, the seas of sadness. Looks like Fred's going through it. You should go check on him. It's part of your job as a concierge. Oh yeah, I'm the concierge of the silent to keep everyone happy. Alright. So Fred's depressed. Let's go, let's go undepress him. Ooh, berries. Hang on, wait. Can I chop rocks? I can chop rocks. Ooh, they turned to gold. Okay, that's cool. That's cool. I went my backpack. You forgot at. coin. You forgot coin. Wait, I'm expanding my inventory first so I can keep more stuff. Okay, you want to pop the coin again? There you go. You annoyed. You annoyed. I'm gonna steal all this. Oh, apparently I'm building a snack bar. For no reason. I don't know why, but I'm gonna chop down every tree here. Hey, there's a guy over there called Slicks. Why he's so slick? Oh, you got some iron. Yep, I got some iron ore there. I can certainly say okay. the music is cozy. It is. I got a larch tree here. I'm missing my axe swings. My guy can't. <laughs> yeah, Maybe you should give him your glasses. I don't know. Probably. Okay, let me go customize. Um, where is it? 
backpack customization. Do you have hats? I have hats, yeah. Is there bucket hats? I might have a bucket hat. Put a bucket hat on that mother trucker. I oh my god, look at a witch's hat! This one? Lol, that's so cute! <laughs> You're gonna get lost that in character hat. customized. Look, 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 look. Up. Up. Down. Straw yeah. hat. I know it's not a book of half, but it's the closest thing. Can I be Mozart? What about oh, my Lord, straw hat? No. That's a good hat. <laughs> but there is a witch's hat, yes. Oh my god! <laughs> little ears, look little key ears. Yeah, you could do that too. <laughs> yes. Okay, I'll stick with that then. Take my bridle now. Okay, now. I went with this for the Asian vibe. There's also some random armor for no reason. Whoa. Campfire 01. Business suit. No. Jacket. You turn into a leather. Sailor. <laughs> oh, that's so cute. Okay, I'll keep that this one. I can tell yeah, when she likes get, it. Get better pants, yeah, get better pants. No. Short shorts. Oh my god, that's so cute. <laughs> yeah. Well, there you go. And now my shoes. I gotta have some Jimmy Chews. You gotta get them red shoes. Set them at your tie. Red shoes like that? Yeah. Okay. No, 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 no. See the ones just down and to the left. This one. Yeah, they're way better. How about these? A bit more. Okay, yeah, I like them too. Okay. <laughs> oh my god, you're so cute! <laughs> ah, ah, ah. Oh lord. What have I unleashed? So cute! Complete building quest unlock this building. Removing debris. I'll just keep, I'll just keep like acquiring stuff coin 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 coin, coin coin yep my gold my precious gold gold dude he can't aim his axe like what is What's wrong on the ground that honeycomb like yeah, a, honey. a honey thing yeah it's just honey yeah. nice the axe's hitbox is a little strange because it's like they need to work a little bit on the axe hitbox for sure but apparently yeah. I don't need a pickaxe. I can just whack. A lot of everything. Yep. Well, you know what? I will... Oh, is that a warring can? Look at the little warring can. What? The left. The little this... warring can. Watering can? Yeah, there's see it. Look, stop, stop. Right there. Or is it a little teapot? A little it's a little teapot. teapot, yeah. But this is actually oh, just junk and debris. Well, can't you... You should be able to collect that teapot, bro. Nah, I'm just gonna remove the debris. No, I know. I'm saying you should be able to collect the teapot. I know. Maybe in future they will. You got your own little house? I... maybe? I don't know yet. I'm still in the early stages. Why don't we okay. progress the island first? Alright, let's go. Okay, let's go heal Fred's depression. Bless his little soul. I'll just give him all those disconnections from the world again I hit him I'll hit him with the uh... acts of love no 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 I'll hit I'll hit him with all my music you know yep never really know what Fred be going through what he going through what he going through <laughs> sick and tired of the fact that ain't nobody really care about Fred I just don't so understand. We care about Fred. You care about Fred. I'm just here to poke him. Find out why Fred is said. Fred. You love Fred, lol. Yeah, I do. Fred is a cat, and that means I love Fred. Okay. So, hey Fred, why are you sad, man? 
Come on, tell me the deets. Let's see if it'll translate that. Oh, it really did. Oh, lol, it does. <laughs> Can you do me a solid and find out why Steve's got his whiskers in a twist? Follow this trail of seashells to find Steve and unravel the mystery, matey. All right, so now we gotta find out why Steve-O's mad. The right what? next count. Yep, time for Australian accent. But please don't. <laughs> no, suffer. Wow, nice blue shorts. Commenting on my shorts, the first thing. My eyes up here, pal. What's on your mind today? He's a frisky kitty. <laughs> yeah. Ah. Well, you see, Steve, I was just wondering, why are you mad at Fred? You have to give us the details, brother. Hmm. Well, let me tell you a tale about Fred and a mix-up with a surprise party that didn't go quite as planned. Let's say it involved a cake, a cat, and a very unexpected twist. Now go find Fred and spill the beans about why I'm still fuming at him. If you wouldn't mind, of course. Ow. Sure, pal. I'll go talk to him right away. All right. Is there anything else I could do for you today, good sir? And of course, please make sure to make extra croquets for my lunch. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I'll translate the last bit, but yeah. Did except for the <laughs> yes. Just enjoy those croquets. Let me know how it goes with Fred. Good luck. You got it, Palo. Now, look at me with my little axe over there, looking like a murderer. <laughs> hey, Fred the Dread. I, I don't know why Fred's messages disappear. Like, <laughs> anyway, it doesn't matter. Well, listen, I spoke with Steve, and it turns out that he's mad about a birthday and a cake and an unexpected twist with a cat. Does any of that ring a bell, Fred? Wow, he just skipped over the whole thing and just goes, how about you catch a fish as a peace offering? Bring me a shiny silver fish to, me to mend things with Steve. Okay, bro. You have to go and get the fish for him to make amends with Steve. Like, bro, how about you go catch your own fish? No, 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 I'm a fish right now. Aim towards the water and cast your rod. All right, I'm going to drown in the water right now. <laughs> <laughs> Disconnected from the world again. Oh my God, look at that fish. It's so ugly. <laughs> a yellow striper. Nice. Bring it to you. No, I'm going to catch some more. You get nah, the fish. Fam, you haven't seen... You haven't seen an ugly fish until you see the hair in their fish. A sword chub, look at it. It's so chubby. Look at it, it's so derpy. It's so cute. <laughs> you find this cute? Hey, it's yes. hamster buttocks. Hamster buttocks is fishing. Can you and... interact with a hamster? A sword chub. No, I can't. I can't. Aww. Maybe no social features yet, <laughs> but maybe in future, yeah. like when there's actual like proper online play and stuff like a yeah. blue tang. Okay, I'll give him Ooh. a sword chub. Thanks for catching the fish. Say silver fish. Oh no, okay, any fish. Yeah, I'll just give him a sword chub. Yay, quest complete. A sword chub be a mighty fine gift for me to mend my friendship with Steve. Fair winds and following seas to you. Ah, oh, no problem, matey. Now, what's the next quest? <laughs> well, hey there. You're really getting settled in nicely. I need your help with something. Could you meet me at the pier? All right, Mayor Thompson. You got it. And you know what? I'll even bring my axe. Hello. <laughs> Is that fish just randomly on the ground? What? Is that a fish just randomly on no, the ground? No, it's seashell. Conch. Oh, it's a seashell. Yes. It looks like a fish, the sheep. I sell seashells by the seashore. Also, for anybody watching this, I'm also watching this on my phone, so it's really small. Okay, which eyes? 
<laughs> oh god oh good lord these are the normal eyes i got the shifty eyes no. the cute eyes the girly eyes the extra cute eyes the normal eyes the slightly goku cross-eyed and the derp where's the derp oh definitely the derp wait where's the derp i, I swear it was just here it was one it was there it was one of the first ones it was that it was that one wasn't it yeah but it doesn't look as derpy as before it does yeah 100 percent that one okay fine the derp <laughs> yeah Well, hey there, it's my favorite villager. You must be here to help me with the boardwalk upgrade project. I really need your help. Come talk to me when you have a second and I'll tell you more. I have a second right now, homie. Like right now, homie. Or, well, as one of our friends would say, what is the saying? <laughs> what? Well, he said, I need help right now. So I said, or as one of our friends would say, what is the saying? Right now. <laughs> ah, ah, I need to catch on. Okay, let's see what he has to say. Hmm, 1,000, 50,000. Oh boy, how am I going to get the money? Well there, Mayor. I heard you need some help with getting some money. So, uh, what's going on? Why don't you tell your old friend here and I'll help you out? Well, you heard about my little predicament, did you? Well, listen. I need funds to upgrade the Campfire Bod Boardwalk Pier. Go chat with Steve and he might have some ideas. Head to the map and locate Steve to get some ideas for the upgrade project. Hi. I almost forgot to tell you. You can use the map to locate the villagers. Locate Steve using the map. <laughs> okay. Sherlock Holmes here. Steve-o. Alright. We're gonna go talk to Steve-o, eh? You know what? I wonder. I'm just going to. Bro, I hope they bring this out on Xbox. I would totally play this. You are some kind of nerd, but yes, I'm sure you will. I would. I would totally play this. Why would you play such a thing, huh? Why would you? Why not? Why would Hilarious. you? Hilarious. Why wouldn't I? Well, how to do, friendo? Such a beautiful day on the island. How's your day going so far? <laughs> the second he brought that out, I had to go with that. Right. Well, listen, Steve. Um, I need to ask about the funding for the boardwalk upgrade. How are we going to get the money? You know, the mayor's been stressing about this uh, quite a bit. So I was wondering, do you have any suggestions? Oh, my God. My eyes turned to stars. Yeah, well, the old funding dilemma, huh? Well, rumor has it there was treasure on this island. Grab this metal detector and start hunting. Don't be a doubloon. Grab that metal detector and let's hunt for some treasures. Your metal detector is in your backpack. Open your backpack and start using it. <clears throat> okay, now I must do one more voice for you guys. All right, time to be the Chinese businessman. Okay. I understand now. Whenever I hear the beeping, the beeping get closer, then I'm going closer to the treasure. Oh man, I'm gonna dig straight away. <laughs> wow, pearl necklace. Nice. You think I'm gonna sell that? I send that straight to Cass. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes, you know, you must have one type of pearl necklace, then there's two types of pearl necklace. But the second type, we don't oh talk about Lord. ever. Now then, we go find the mayor. I just found a pearl necklace. Don't worry, not the second kind. We're gonna deliver it to you. No problem. She's getting close to that Bart Simpson laugh. That's how you know she's having a great time. He's like, <laughs> hey. Actually, sorry, that was that was closer to Krusty. My apologies. <laughs> well, friend, any good news about finding money to help with upgrading the boardwalk pier? Well, Mayor, don't you worry. All right. I found a pineapple. <laughs> uh, and a I, starfish. I can't. I can't. Where's the... 
Where's the necklace? Ah, oh, well, never mind. Maybe well, you listen, have Mayor. To Maybe you have to tell it. No, well, I'll tell him first. Well, listen, Mayor, I found a pearl necklace, and I'm not quite sure what to do with it. I found the treasure by using a metal detector. Could this help you out, maybe? Auction it off to raise some funds? Great find! Ah! New memory created. Close the chat and start the peer upgrade. Excellent, partner! We're getting an awesome upgrade on our peer! There's the Wheel of Wonder. Spin it to unlock new visitors and invite them to visit. Oh, yeah. Complete the We Have a Visitor quest to unlock the wheel. We... Oh. So it's not even locked yet. Okay. Hey, hey. I think Steve needs help with something. Do you mind paying him a visit? Can I just say that Steve is the most incompetent person on this island? Nah, nah, nah. He's good. He's good. He's fine. He's cool. He's cool. All right. He's cool. Why are you, why, cool, but he's still why are you going at Steve like that, huh? Steve O. He needs help. A Steve O needs help with everything. But this is the way he is. Yeah. He's Steve O. He is. And incompetent. <laughs> Maybe he just needs a lot of help. Blueberries, raspberries, flower. Oh, hey, sorry. I was going through my bagel recipe. Come talk to me when you have a minute. <laughs> well, Ooh, I got a minute a right now. I don't know, maybe he's got some kind of weird fruit bagel. Right. Hey there, friend. I was reading over my famous recipe when you sneaked up on me, famous. Say, think you can help me out? Well, what do you need help with? <laughs> Actually, wait. Let me think a bit more. <laughs> hey. I wonder... I w and you probably shouldn't do this, right? Because obviously you're trying to showcase this game. Mm -hmm. But I wonder what they would do if you were like super mean to them. We will find out off camera. <laughs> yeah, 100%. Hey, so uh, I heard you need some help, Steve. What exactly is it you need help with? Do you think you could tell me? Oh, absolutely. I need your help to fix up the bakery so we can bake a special bagel for Angelina. <laughs> it's Angelina again. <laughs> Head oh, up there and get go. it sorted. Don't forget to sell something at the drop box to get the coins for the bakery. Okay. Coolio. Yeah, we'll just sell our stuff to help you out, Steve. Okay. Yeah, that's what we do. We are the concierge. Yeah, we're greedy. Go make <laughs> your own money, bro. What if Steve doesn't know how sell to make money? Your... But Steve knows how to make famous bagels. Let him sell some of them. I'm not completing this. Aw, oh, I have to complete the sale straight away. Alright. It's got a 10 minute cooldown. Dude, I could have sold my whole inventory. Bruh. Bruh. Bruh, come on. Oh, Buy the bakery for five coins. Alright. It'll take around five minutes to complete building it. Why don't we speed that up? You can use diamonds to skip the timer. Ah. No. No, no, I, these are free Don't anyway. Be wasting your diamonds, bruh. Nah, skipped. It was part of the quest. Playing the building. Nice work, pal. The upgrade's all done. So hmm. patient. Yep. I need to go get flour to make a bagel. Flour. Flour. Fake egg. Lol. Not sure why that exists, but okay. Nice work, pal. You're almost ready to make your first bagel. Head back to the bakery and let's make a bagel. Somehow I also teleported toward a rock. That was fantastic. Right. Wee boost. You know, I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get some berries, because why not? It's here. You know, I'm gonna steal a butterfly. They're gonna call me Mr. Steal Your Coconuts and Steal Your Butterflies. Why do the bananas look like look like brown? Overripe. Overripe, maybe overhyped. Ooh, I have a bagel now. Click the bagel. Spend 10 diamonds. Okay. I've made a bagel at high speed. Kaz would just have random food just going in her oven 24-7. Yep. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Hold on. Back. Can make banana Q. Upgrade. Oh, I can upgrade the bakery oven if I wanted to. Nice. 
Okay, next quest. I don't suppose you've noticed there's a few construction sites around the island that haven't been built up yet. Those are the bungalows, and I think you'll find they're pretty neat. You can invite new visitors to the island by building bungalows for them to stay in. Why don't we try them out now? Okay, sure. I you might can buy a bungalow for other people, but you don't even have a house of your own. Nah, I don't need a house. I sleep in the open. I sleep in Steve's truck. <laughs> Excuse me. Ooh, constructing a bungalow is easy. I'm not going to skip a timer of three seconds, so I'm just going to go with that. Yeah. Perfecto. Now you've built the bungalow for a new visitor. It's time to get a new visitor card and invite them to the island. All right. We'll finish out after we get the new visitor. Let's go. There you are. Now go up to the wheel and unlock your very first visitor. All right. Weekend. It better be legendary. Moana. Come on, Moana. Come on, Moana. I know it's going to be copyright, but come on. Oh, common. Can I, can I, I've got 214 vouchers. Can I just, you know, like not choose this person? <laughs> Alma Kindheart. I'm gonna roll again. I don't want Alma Kindheart. I want a legendary. Aw, oh, almost to the rare. Who this? Bernie Wimsvale. No. All right, come on, come on, come on, high roller, high roller. It's coming. Oh, come. Who this? Cassia Dewdrop. All right, come on, come on, high roller, high roller. I feel it, I feel it. I already got a Bernie. What am I gonna do with the second Bernie? The place cracked though. Uncommon duplicate. Oh, so I just get two gems. Oh, okay. So I got a second. Rolling. We got one Bernie, and now we've got a second Bernie. One Bernie's enough. <laughs> but what about elevensies? <laughs> we got Arizona Bones. Okay. Sounds like a detective. Oh, what a name. Come on, come on. I just want one rare. Just one rare. Oh, come on. Common. Who's this? It's gonna be Patrick Sullenhand. What a name. Come on, high roller, high roller. It's gotta be rare. It's gotta be rare. Oh, so close. Alright, who's it gonna be? <laughs> Joy Fitwell. This is definitely good. This person's gonna run a gym. I feel it. Yeah. Rare, finally, yes. Yeah. Okay, this is what I was waiting for. You gotta always pull a rare on a video. Serafina Acadia. Oh, she's, Arcadia. Oh. <laughs> she's so cute. Okay, before we end this video, then we must go talk to her. <laughs> Lol. Everything here is pretty adorable. Wonderful, you just unlocked your very oh, first visitor oh. card. Why don't you try inviting them to the island? Head back to the bungalow and invite the visitor. Okay. Okay. Let's go right there. I'm gonna invite... What's her What's her name? Angela Anaconda. <laughs> yeah. I remember the tiger, the Marcadia, whatever her name yep. is. Yep. Let's open up the bungalow. Okay, invite visitor. Invite. Got it. Navigate. Looks like your first visitor is requesting a berry cake. Mm. Yeah, you have to go make a berry cake. Okay. Let's go to the bakery. I am not leaving this game without getting my first visitor berry cake. Okay. I need eggs, a fake egg, two flour, and some sugar. All right. Easy, easy. Easy E. All right. Let's go. I need to go to the general store. Ah, general. Inventory's full. Don't lie to me. Don't lie to me. Mm. Okay, I'll just toss out some of the...
conch shells or whatever that are randomly found. This random starfish. Bye, Patrick. Conch shells. Bye. Mm -hmm. What about... Oh, SpongeBob. Bye. <laughs> mm. Okay. Bought two... Yeah. Two fake eggs. Double flower. And uh, I don't think there is lettuce in a cake. No, there is sugar. So we buy some sugar in the berry cake. Maybe I get some rice and I put in the cake. <laughs> okay. <laughs> now we go bake. So we have the ingredients. Now we go bake the cake. Two hours later, we craft the berry cake. Oh, wow. It really does take two hours. Ten diamonds straight up. Let's go. Oh, my lord. Listen, listen. I want this done. I want to see the visitor. I want... Hello. Okay. Deliver. Oh my god. We don't even get to pick the villager and we got this guy. <laughs> Where's my rare? Oh, well, this is Joy. You fit well, I guess. <laughs> Hooray! What a wonderful sight. I can't wait to see what vibrancy they add to our special little island. Now there's only one thing left to do. Go say hello. Make your guests happy and keep them on the island longer. Chat with them regularly and fulfill their requests. Okay. Cool. Let's talk to them. Ready to break a sweat? How's your day on the island? Well, my day was fantastic. How about you? How are you enjoying the island resort? Is everything to your satisfaction? You know, do you think you'd be willing to stay longer here? I'm just really, really keen to find out more about how you're feeling about my island. Her tail is wagging with excitement on this island. The natural beauty is positively, positively, ladies and gents, inspiring. Let's keep the fitness fun going. I see you're a bit of a fitness junkie. Um, could you tell me more about uh, how you like to exercise and keep fit? What is the best exercise that you can recommend for a Chinese man that's about 34 years old? <laughs> Tai Chi by the shore. Wow, old man exercise. Okay, you just offended my entire generation. I go away now. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> All right, ladies and gents. That brings us to a positively inspiring session of this lovely island. Thank you guys very much for watching this video. A little bit about this. This game is called um, Co Campfire Cozy Friends. You can wishlist it on Steam right now. All right, I don't have a release date for this game, but I was really thankful for the opportunity to play this. I was only going to do a half hour session, but honest to God, we actually managed to spend a total of, wow, 43 minutes on this game, just going around doing shenanigans. So please, if you honestly, like... Honestly, it's a really good game. I would buy this. Like, I would genuinely play this game. Yep. No, I'm just, I'm just glad you would, because that's really, really interesting. Uh, let me just pull up the Steam page so that everyone can have a look and see it. That's Campfire Cozy Friends right there. Do check it out if you... Oh, wait. Maybe that's a little too big. Do check it out on Steam. Do wishlist. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more of my videos. Thank you all very much. We'll see you on the next one. And Kaz, thank you so much for being a guest on my recording. You're oh, yeah. Bye-bye. Oh, yeah.